proceedings in the trial of the former minister of Niger Delta, LDB, for false declaration of asset continued at the Code of Conduct Tribunal with the opening of his defence. Oruvewe told the tribunal that the land for which he has been charged was allocated to him by the government, but he sold it to his landlord, one Akinwumi Ajibola, for 10 million naira to offset the two-year house rent he owed the said landlord. He said it would have been a crime for him to claim ownership of the property he had sold and the certificate of occupancy, which was handed over to the buyer before he left office. He therefore urged the tribunal to dismiss the charge against him because he has not breached any law concerning the property. Corroborating his testimony, Mr. Akinwumi Ajibola confirmed to the tribunal that he was the former landlord of the minister and that the minister owed him 10 million naira for two years' rent. He said he is also a real estate developer and that the former minister parted with the empty land allocated to him to offset the debt. He told the tribunal that the certificate of occupancy was handed over to him at the end of the transaction. On the cross-examination by the prosecutor, Mr. Muhammad Diri, the witness said he did not register the power of attorney and the deed of assignment because he bought an empty land in the bush and he was not ready to develop it at that time. He also said that at the point he wanted to develop the said property, he found out that someone else had encroached on it and he has entered into a discussion with the company that encroached on the said property. For today, it was okay. There was no problem. Uh, the witnesses for the defense testified and we put them under cross-examination and we got what we want to get under the cross-examination, yes. The only gap that was there was why did you not declare uh, 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 that, that asset that bears your name. And today he has explained it, that that asset that bears his name, which he did not declare, he had parted with it to a third party and who has come to give evidence and with evidence, evidence and documentary evidence uh, tendered in support thereof. The former minister is standing trial on a one-count charge of false declaration of asset by the Code of Conduct Bureau. Amaka Okafo, Channels Television News.